Basketball Championship presented by Capital One. It is a picture perfect day in Norman, Oklahoma, and we start with a team that has been pretty close to perfect all season long. The number one overall seed, Oklahoma Sooners, taking on the Missouri Tigers with a spot in the regional final on the line. Now, Oklahoma won their nation leading 44th consecutive game. 3-1 bounces off the dirt. Coleman fired up just to get on base. And Jennings fouled off a couple that were not able to be caught. This one is, and she is retired. 2-0 to Lee. Finds a gap into right field. It's coming to the home of the six-time national champs. Hansen has it caught, and Gallagher over at second, able to get out number two. Sanders swings and hard hit ball down the line. Coleman comes through, Lee follows suit, and the Sooners take the lead. Both sides of the plate. Sid Sanders, watch how tight she keeps her hands. This is a pitch on the inner half of the plate. She's able to keep her hands in, but get her barrel through enough to keep the ball fair. This is what Oklahoma does. They know how to perform. That base running, that allowed Oklahoma to get two runs. Pop up to right. Jackson has it, and that will end the... Laird certainly leading that charge if she can find a way on. Hits it over to Lyons at shortstop, and the three-time Big 12 dynamic duo in the one-two spot. Looked like she went and she... No inside, both players going for it. Somehow, Hanson keeps that in her glove. Okay, a lot of sunshine here today in the 70s as Brito hits it to Laird for out number one. Regional at bat. Could be over in one pitch, and it is. And give her the ball in this situation. She's going to let her defense go to work and get three up, three down in that. Quality opponents. And the message was, well, we know we're not going to host, but let's see. Lions on top of it. Four out number two. In supers. Gallagher hits it to Jennings, and it's another three up. That pitch does miss low, so Coleman. Back in the first. Holman was on the move. She'll have to go back as this one is caught by Honnold out in center. She'll have another hit in this game, and Coleman is on the move. They're giving her the signal to come on home. The throw won't even be made. Haley Lee stumbles a little bit over at second, but is in safely with us. Hey, opposite field hitting from Haley Lee, and not just opposite field hitting, but with power as she drives in her legs, gets this ball all the way to the fence, and that leadoff walk that Lauren Krings gave up to Jada Coleman comes back a second time to hurt the top innings. When they have a ton of momentum, they can put up runs in a hurry. Hanson, see ya! Hurry! Kinsey Hanson smacks one over the fence for two more ball as well and swinging as confident as Kinsey Hansen here in Norman this pitch left too much over the plate Hansen knew it the moment it left the bat Oklahoma making a statement early in this game and Oklahoma has Well, it's a good way to finish the inning. Back-to-back -back strikeouts. Ball 
Got it. A little bit of a delayed call from our home plate umpire, but it was indeed. Back to back strikeouts. Get the job done. Too much instead of just reacting. Swing and a miss. One, two, three. Alyssa Brito leading off the inning with a hit. Erickson went down for it, and then Brito had to leap over the ball. Last year had a three-run home run in game two of the champ series, and she comes through here with a hit. Excitable Jada Coleman with runners on the corners. Runner is going to second, and she overslid. That actually might have been an opportunity to tag. Put this game in danger of ending early in the next inning. Pop ball, and now the throw home. It's a great throw! And Missouri takes one away. Outfield taking away a potential run for the Sooners and ending the inning. She is patient and will take the walk. That is the first walk issued by the Oklahoma. There is the strikeout call. Up over the glove of ball, and then it is off the glove of Lions. Now, runners on the corners for Missouri. A walk put Laird on. 0 oh, 2. Hit in the dirt. Laird waiting to see where it goes. The throw to first, and. The runner will go to second, but Laird has to hang out at third. And there it is. Missouri threatens. They walk, they hit, but they cannot score. The Super Regional. Good start once again to the inning. Single and a double. Laird. Gold Glove shortstop trying to work two, not quite. Schumacher has to field her position and does for out number two. Eight transfer. Runner all the way over to third on that difficult situation the last inning with some good defense. This ball pops away. The runner's coming home. The battery cannot make the play. Crenshaw tossed it back to Schumacher, but not in time to catch Lee. Play defense. Haley Lee makes her decision, fully commits to getting into the plate, goes straight in, beats the ball. And this is an Oklahoma team that the minute the ball gets away, they are Sanders. Oh. As a hitter, when you know, you know with one. And watch Sid Sanders drop the bat immediately. Every hitter out there knows when you are on time and connect and have that type of power, this ball goes into Home Run Village. Home Run Village is pumped about it. <laughs> what a net bat from Sid Sanders worked into a full count. And here they sit down seven. This should end the inning and does. So Oklahoma will have to settle for seven. Fielder for the Sooners. Torres has come in out in right field and Lions on top of it. Jackson pops it up. Boone in from the outfield to make the grab, and that will do it for inning number five. Sooners on these appearances represented on the wall in the outfield here at Marita Hines Field. Brito 
hits it to Laird for out number one of the six. On those two championship runs the last couple years can do. She wants to see how these players handle the postseason stage. Well, Torres has herself another hit. A Pullman spot would be on deck. Boone chops it out into center. And that will bring up the home run leader for the Oklahoma Sooners. Top of the order, Jada Coleman. Full count. And she will take the walk. Bases loaded now for the first time in this game for Tiara Jennings for Oklahoma. Doesn't waste any time. This will just be a long out. It will get another run across. Out. And new pitcher, no problem for Tiara Jennings. This is the first pitch she sees, was hunting a pitch on the outer part of the plate. Gets the sack fly. Just a productive at bat, and that's what Oklahoma can do each. Ooh, that one got away from her. Break, or at least a swing. And she won't get it. Walks in the run. <laughs> Oklahoma, the red shirt. Get a hit, so she comes in looking for one and gets it. One pitch was all she needed to get a hit and score two more. It continues. Oklahoma showing you their depth from the bench. This pitch is inside. It's a little inside out swing. But Green has enough power to get it to the outfield. Two more runs for Oklahoma. She was ready to swing that time, but didn't make contact. And now the Tigers end the inning, but three hits. Another full count pitch, and Snyder got stuck, but swing, swung? Anyway. Team, this is just, just turning the lineup over for the third time. Another strikeout, this time looking for Deal. And Alex Honnold pops it up, and game over. Sooners on their way to the regional final with their 45th consecutive win of the season and another run rule win the NCAA tournament more than any other team ever.